We begin with breaking news this noon. New developments in the deadly shooting of Philadelphia police officer Robert Wilson gunned down during a robbery attempt. Hello, everyone. I'm Yuki Washington, along with Erica Bontia. Let's get to right to Eyewitness News reporter Todd Kenyonis. He is live at police headquarters where police just wrapped up a news conference detailing the heroic efforts of Officer Wilson. Todd, what have you learned? Hi, Erica. We just learned that there were more than 50 shots fired during this gun battle with uh, Officer Robert Wilson. Uh, two of those suspects were involved in that uh, gun battle with the officer. And we've just been told that uh, one of those suspects who was shot in the leg during that gun battle right now has Officer uh, Wilson's handcuffs uh, attached to him as he is secured right now uh, to his hospital bed. Just a couple of minutes ago, police say that the brothers, 30-year-old Carlton Hips and 26-year-old Ramon, Ramon Williams have been arrested and now charged with killing the 22nd District Police Officer uh, Robert Wilson. Wilson was inside the GameStop video store buying a video game for his eight-year-old son when police say Hips and Williams walked into that store in order to rob it. The eight-year veteran then confronted the suspects and the gunfire erupted uh, inside the store there at 22nd and Lehigh just before 5 o'clock yesterday evening. Police say Williams has confessed to the shooting and told investigators they never saw Officer Wilson's patrol car with his partner inside parked uh, just outside that video game store and that the suspects thought that the store would, quote, be an easy target. Now, during a press conference here just moments ago, Police Commissioner Charles Ramsey said Officer Wilson was heroic in not only confronting the men, but also in the measures that he took to protect the lives of the employees and customers who were inside at the time. He's moving back and forth, firing at both suspects uh, that were both firing at him. He was taking rounds. He was actually being hit uh, during the exchange of gunfire, but he continued to fight, continued to shoot until the fatal wound was, uh, was fired and it brought him down. I've seen a lot of um, heroic actions on the part of police officers over the years. Very proud to be part of this profession. I've not seen any that rose above what I saw on that video. It was absolutely incredible what this officer was able to do. Well, Officer uh, Wilson was pronounced dead last night at Temple University Hospital at around 625 in the evening. He was shot uh, multiple times, including once to the head. Uh, both suspects have criminal records, and we'll get more into that tonight at 5 and 6. But for now, reporting live from Philadelphia Police Headquarters, Todd Quinones, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Todd, thank